What up guys, got a song request, a little subby request today from my main man Jerome. It's been a little while, it's been actually a long while since I've been able to do this. So I wanted to get it to you, it's called Holy, I think just, that's the name of it, just Holy, or Holy, 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 uh, Donnie McLurkin. So I gotta be honest, I don't know the song super, super well, but I was listening to it and listening to it. And I started loving it, started praising to, to it, started worshiping to it. So I'm going to do the best I can to teach it. Um, it's in the key of F. So we got to go capo, third fret, and then we're going to be playing these D shapes. So really the song is pretty easy. There's not that many chords. There's really only like four chords. But um, you'll just have to like play around with it. The timing might be a little bit something you need to work on. It's something that I've had to work on a little bit on this song. So it's just gonna start off with a D. And usually when I play in the key of D, um, I usually just play it just kind of like that high E string open. But for this song, I kind of feel like I'm gonna throw that middle finger on the high E string on the second fret. I call it kind of like that country D. So I'm gonna be playing that one. So it's gonna sound something like this. And I will lift my voice and I will sing and I will sing holy holy to my Lord and Savior my God and King, and I will sing holy, holy. So that's literally just, I mean, it's that's the whole verse one. Uh, so let me, just, let's just circle back. Uh, we'll go through that a little, through that a little bit more um, slowly. So first of all, if you need help on these chords, I got some pictures, some of that stuff going on on the screen. But also I have a lesson um, specifically showing you where my fingers are going for each chord. Um, so I'll link that up top and in the description below just if you need some additional help if you're a beginner. Um, and then also I have a lesson I do on which strings you should be strumming. So like, you know, for this D chord, you don't want to be strumming all the strings. And this A chord, you don't want to be strumming all the strings. So I have a lesson. I think it'll really help you out. Um, so if if you need that, that's uh, that's available. So uh, again, just verse one. Uh, we're just going D. I will lift my voice and A to the G, and I will sing. And again, for this song, for whatever reason, this full G here, it just kind of sounds right to me. Instead of doing my what I would normally do, like play that play that G like that I have up here. But you can do either one. You can do either G. Either either G. So anyways, D. And I will lift my voice and I will sing and I will sing holy holy to my Lord and Savior my God and King, I will sing holy, holy. So, you know, you can just start off with some of those simple down strums until you get a little bit more familiar with the song, the timing, you start adding a little bit more rhythm in there. Uh, but that's going to be your, your verse. Uh, your verse is, so verse 1 and then verse 2 also. So before we get to... Um, well, actually, yeah, so we'll just go right to the chorus here. So it goes A to the G to the D. And I will praise the Lamb of God who sits upon the throne. I will worship Him and give the praise to Him alone. Forever, 
forever. First to all the angels sing, and they bow down. So let's go back to that chorus. Um, the first couple lines, pretty easy. We're just going A, G, D. So, I will praise the Lamb of God who sits upon the throne. And I will worship Him and give the praise to Him alone. He who was in it and is to come. I will, so we hit the B minor there, I will sing D over F sharp before, before, and I will sing before his throne forever. So B minor, D over F sharp, forever, forever, and then you're back into the, to the verse, so... Um, and then just, you know, the verse two is same as, as verse one, uh, the, the little, I guess I'll call it the bridge or the vamp at the end is just, uh, where, you know, he's, uh, singing holy, 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 holy. It's just that same pattern as same progression as the verse, the D to the A to the G. So I think that's more or less a, a good breakdown as to what you can do starting off in this song. Um, you can also finger pick that, that first verse, um, if you wanted to, and maybe even that first chorus, uh, just to kind of give it a little bit of a nicer feel. I will sing, and I will sing holy, holy, to my Lord and Savior, my God and King, and I will sing holy. So I'm just, I'm really, I'm, I'm not following any specific pattern when I'm finger picking that. I'm just getting into my finger picking position on the right side here. So I've got a lesson, finger pick like a worship leader with just three fingers. Um, so if you need help on that, uh, that'll go up top and in the description below. Um, I go through a full breakdown of where my fingers need to be going for each, on each string. So really, I'm just kind of doing that same pattern. I'm using the thumb to pluck the bass note. So the D. I will lift my voice in A. I will sing. I will sing holy, holy. So it's literally just that thumb, pointer, thumb, middle. Thumb, pointer, thumb, middle. Thumb, pointer, thumb, middle. I mean, that's as, that's as simple as it gets. It's, it's so easy once you kind of get that structure down. And then, as I always say, you just kind of add some filler notes in between. And usually, I'm just kind of picking on this, the thumb on the D string and then my pointer on the um, G string. And I will sing holy And then if you wanted to add, you know, your ring finger in there on that high E string. You could definitely do that too. So anyways, that's a wrap. That shows you how to play the song. Um, if you need questions or if you have questions or need anything, leave a comment. Let me know what you're struggling with, what you need help with. Um, I love just kind of connecting with you guys here and getting to know you and getting to help you on your, your worship journey and your guitar journey um, as well. So if you're new, head on over to the community tab on my channel. I've got some verses of the week I post, kind of blog style, uh, some, some words of encouragement, some 
live stream updates, subscriber giveaways, some other stuff like that. So head on over there, say hello, let me know where you're from, how long you've been playing, how the playing's coming along, and uh, I'd love to just, you know, connect with you. So anyways, that's a wrap. Love y'all. Hope you guys have a great day, a great week, and I'll catch you in the next one.